Welcome to all of you. I appreciate you coming online for this crucial training. My name is Athena. We gained 70 advanced verbs. In this lesson, I'll be expanding on the previous videos. But in case you missed them, the links to those videos are included in the description below. We'll go on to the 8th section now. Going for a walk in the woods helps me clear my head and feel less stressed. Helps me unwind. 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 And it's important to remember that it's unwind, not unwind. Wine. Wine helps me unwind. Wine helps me unwind. You can hear it's the same I sound. We use this verb at the end of the day, at the end of the week, or after something stressful. When you unwind, you do something that helps you feel less stressed. Listening to soothing music can help you unwind and forget about your worries for a while. Number two, tomato plants grow really well in sunny climates. Tomato plants thrive, thrive, thrive. When a person, a plant, or an Animal. The economy thrives. It does very well. There is positive energy to it. Her son is thriving at university. He's getting good scores on his exams. He has an active social life. Mm. He loves where he lives. He's thriving. The startup company started to thrive after securing a significant investment. They made over a million dollars in six months. Wow. Imagine I'm a carpenter and I'm building a table. My client has a couple of requests. I need to make the table longer. I also need to make the table wider. I need to make the table higher. And I need to make the chairs shorter. Make longer. Lengthen. Lengthen. Lengthen the table. Make wider. Widen, widen, widen the table. Make higher, heighten, heighten, heighten the table. Make shorter, shorten, shorten, shorten the chairs. You can see we've done three, four, five, six, all together. I need to lengthen this curtain because it's too small for the window. We can use this verb for physical things, but not always. The word refrigerator is often shortened to fridge. Reading books regularly can help you widen your vocabulary. Number seven, the judge told Michelle that she must agree to his order and do what he says. She must comply, comply, comply. When we comply, we agree to do what someone says. We agree to do what a judge or lawyer says. The police a doctor, the government, something formal and official. So we wouldn't say 
my mom told me to clean my room and I complied. That is a bit unnatural. International businesses need to comply with the laws and customs of the countries they operate in. Visitors to the museum are expected to comply with the no flash photography policy to preserve the art box. You can see we say comply or comply with something. In order to protect the man's identity, his face was made less clear. His face was blurred. Blur. Blur. When we blur something, we make it less clear. In today's digital age, social media can often blur the lines between real life friendships and online connections. Blur the lines is actually an idiom. It means the difference between two things is not so clear. Number nine, bad words in a TV series are often covered with a strip sound. Bad words are often censored. Censor. Censor. When something is censored, it is covered or hidden because it is inappropriate. We can censor the bad language with a beep sound. We can censor the images by blurring them or pixelating them. The author was asked to censor certain passages in her novel to comply with publishing guidelines. The controversial scene was censored from the TV show before it aired to avoid backlash. Number 10. Last one. He started a project which he knew was difficult and would take a long time. He undertook a project. Undertake. Undertake. Notice how this verb is irregular. Undertake. Undertook. Undertaken. When you undertake something, it's something big and challenging. Normally, it takes a long time. The city council plans to undertake a major infrastructure development project in the city. Infrastructure, we're talking about roads, buildings, bridges, things like that. As a private investigator, Frank is often asked to undertake complex cases. The eighth part is done. I appreciate you viewing this lesson. If this was beneficial, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Bye!